is. <gasps> Yo, we did it. Yo, we did it. No way. All right, what is going on everybody? It's Theme here and welcome to today's video on the channel. And in today's video, I got some good news for y'all. If you read the title or the thumbnail, you already know. Or if you're in the Discord server. But basically, as you can see, we hit Warlord on the storm. Now, this is a big deal because storm has been really bad for all of fifth age and we just finally were able to do it you know so as you can see right here we are the number one ranked player right now and we are obviously storm 2001 rating um i went to 26 and 2 both of my losses were snipes with like 100 resist so pretty much undefeated but uh yeah we did it and I, as you can see i got the warlord robe as well but um it's been a long time coming man and i'm really really happy i look forward to streaming over on twitch storm again and yeah the first bit of the video here will be describing how i played storm my gear setup my deck setup stuff like that tips and tricks and then I will have my warlord match and my reaction uh, a little bit towards the end of the video and I will have timestamps for y'all if you want to see the match or you know see the tips and stuff like that and uh, yeah uh, thank y'all for the love recently on the channel um, if you guys are new though feel free to sub and consider leaving a like rating it would mean a lot to me and uh let me know who you want me to go for on uh, like you know my next warlord you know i want to get two warlords this season or three so uh let me know down there in the comments below but uh yeah we are the first storm warlord at level 160 and i am just very proud of us i really really am and yeah i will let the footage roll y'all and i will see you on the next one i hope you enjoy the video and take care y'all well y'all we made it this far we're the only storm for the first three pages pretty much and then um it's tasha and soul sword at captain we're uh doing pretty good so far um i really hope i do not get a veteran that's only three rank so i need to at least match a knight um I did just play Cass on his balance, actually. He was storm warded, and uh, it was a really close game. So uh, I kind of wish that was my warlord game, but uh, it's all right. Hopefully we get a good one. I guess in the meantime here, while I am waiting uh, for a match, I can show you all the stats I'm running. Um, keep in mind, when the new gauntlet gear comes out, we will be upgrading our gear, and the new gauntlet gear is really good for storm. But um. Right now, I'm running Aeon Hat with an outgoing pin. Um, I tried a balance pin for a game or two. It was not bad. I think I'm going to recommend balance pin and outgoing pin when you get the new boots, obviously. So, one in one there. But uh, Aeon Hat, Robe, Boots, obviously. Nullity Wand, Eternal Athame, Myth Mastery, Fractal Ring. Uh, this is the pet I'm running right now. If you could get Bracetify, that would be pretty helpful, but I don't really care to. Um, I have Mighty Death Word because Death Word is like the hard counter to the strategy we are running at the moment. And Death in general is just really good right now because their stats are really broken. They get to hit through shields and stun you for two rounds with Reader. So, uh, you kinda, you kinda need Ward, you know? You kinda do. Then, uh, obviously, Clockwork Courser. I am running the Aeon deck. Now, I will be recommending the new deck from the new Gauntlet. Basically, it's the same thing here, but you give up a tier slot for a square slot. Um, the only time a tier is better than a square is if you're on a storm playing another storm or a myth. Basically, where you get two-shotted, right? But... I run this because the stats are just really good and I like having that extra health in near matchups and obviously against Myth which is a really really good S tier school right now. So yeah, you got 8.8, 8, 179, 
51 res, 68 to death, uh, can't fizzle, myth banshee, perfect accuracy, uh, kind of low block, but it's not bad, pretty good crit, 56 pierce, uh, 23 outgoing, 50-50 p-serve, and a bit of arch mastery, and perfect pips, so yeah, that's the build. I guess I'll show off the deck too while we're waiting here, you know? I, I mean, I could probably edit this all out, to be honest, but... I feel like there'll be some people interested in the deck setup and um, the gear setup. And I mean, if, if y'all are waiting, I guess in the video too, I guess it's kind of, I don't know, a bit more realistic in a way. I did want to stream, but uh, it's really risky to stream my Warlord match, you know? So I figured I would go about it this way. But um, yeah, I have... Obviously, max stun blocks. Um, I run Glacial and Legend Shield. Now, I used to run Ether Shield because life is really good. But I actually took a tip from my friend Soul Sword and started running Legend Shield. Now, the reason this is good is because Myth is very good right now. Now, you might think, okay, well, you're going to get Betrayaled. Right, but if you Betrayal and bait the scales, you can get a lot of tempo back on a Myth, right? And a lot of this deck you'll be able to tell is me trying to be set for myth because it's like one of the best schools right now. So for example, I have Legend Shield to bait betrayal. I have Eye to try and counter Blade Stack myth, right? I got some heals as well to try and mitigate damage as much as possible at the moment. I do not have a lot of shield breakers because they're not really meta anymore. Like they're still pretty good. You have to pack a couple of shield downers, but um I'm not even running max JDs anymore, I'm just running 3 and 1 Minotaur. That pretty much gets the job done for me. Minotaur is really good uh, situationally, I have noticed, but uh, I got Bottom Path Berry, obviously, max tier Dark and Stormy, max tier Catalan, uh, you know, 2 Queens for Jades, because there are a couple of Jades in queue at the time of me recording this audio. Actually, um... As you see my record here, 25 and 2 right now. My two losses are actually snipes. Um, one was a player who had 109 resist to storm on a jade. And they healed for like, I think 70,000 or something. It was pretty stupid. I reported him. But uh, that was my one loss. And the other one was an ice who was really set for me, unfortunately. So uh, we're basically undefeated this update. And we're about to hit Warlord, which that's pretty darn cool. I guess a tip I could give real quick is a tip I gave to my friend, um, Soulsword. But basically, you want to use your Dark and Stormy as your primary shad now. Um, you have to watch out for Clockwork, like the balance card gearhead. But you don't want to use Rasulka as your primary hit unless you absolutely have to. Or there's like certain situations where Rasulka is better, right? So, for example, right? I can Dark and Stormy in a mirror matchup and very surprise like against a storm and heal and actually win. You just have to be very tactical with how you heal and a lot of the time if they contagion the heal they'll get hit too hard, right? But that's why clock works a lot better because you get tempo and you steal the whole heal, right? So at that point you'll be better off for soul queen, for example. But basically if I have a buff shad and they have a buff shad but I'm hitting first, you're gonna wanna dark and stormy to obviously uh, get a solid hit and mitigate whatever they are doing in advance. Um, if you are, whoops, second. So if I have a buff shad and they have a buff shad but they hit first, you're gonna wanna Rasulka to try and do a bit more damage and get that blade back to try and shift the tempo in your favor, right? And really play around that. That's um a general tip I found this update because Rasulka, if you don't heal, is really bad. You can lose the game off of getting a heal blade. So you have to not really rely on Rasulka anymore, which, you know, a lot of people don't like, but um, I, yeah, I'd recommend rasulka if you're hitting second. But if you're hitting first in the Shad trade, I would recommend Dark and Stormy. Then yeah, I think everything else here is pretty self-explanatory. Um, again, Myth, we have Set Shields, Betrayal, and I. That's the side deck I am running at the moment. Uh, I only have two of these. I don't really need any more from what I've seen. 
at the moment and I started packing a bit less of steel words because I don't know I just don't really seem to need it like three for me is good enough I feel like I just um I I can rely on healing you know a lot for the most part and just hitting really hard so I don't need as many but three is a good number I have noticed galvanic inside obviously putri as well for like mere matchups or you know weirdos who might blade stack on a fire you know putri is just a really broken card in the meta right now and yeah like i said we have galv inside uh two four pips to pull it and then our shuffle for jades obviously um if jades weren't a thing right now i would take out or shuffle and you could probably run beetle inside honestly you could probably run a couple of beetles inside if jading wasn't so popular right now um or stormlord is pretty good but uh i've noticed myth patchy is a lot better in my opinion but uh yeah that's really everything i guess um already getting tired of talking it's been like 10 minutes hasn't it <laughs> yeah it's been 10 minutes wow okay and i personally prefer the elf over the beetle pet now um there's a lot of people who think the beetle pet is better and like i respect your opinion on that but i don't know man for me the elf has just been a staple of storm pvp like the fact you get three and you can elf lock somebody not to mention if you do it at a good time and they counter it with attrition you can just hit through with a hit and a heal and like call it a day you know so i don't know man i really like elf and like there's times where you have like bubble and a blade and you send an elf for like a thousand and it's pretty darn cool and you just really lock them in a spot where they have to either take a trade they don't want or just lose the game basically that's why i like the elf pet and also i mean it looks pretty darn cool right okay now that i've been talking for 10 minutes i need to give my voice a break and i will see you guys when we get the match okay 40 minutes later we finally got a game all right i made a coffee bro i did some laundry i did some i did my teeth like twice bro ready to go all right oh please 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 don't be bad life okay okay i can win this i have two queens in case she's jading and i do pack a shuffle okay Knight? I think that's all I need to get Warlord. Uh, get rid of that, get rid of that, that. Because I think you get three for beating a veteran and four or five to beat a knight. So, as long as she's like 1700, I think we're okay. Okay. Now, I don't have sets for life anymore, so I have to dig from side for debuffs. That's the thing. Okay. Now, I do have a scales for the fuel, which I should keep. We're gonna do that. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, I like the Catalan, but I feel like she would hit and heal, right? Probably. Yeah, it's one wand. There's three more left. Yeah, if I Catalan, I think she just hit and heals, unfortunately, so I can't overextend. Uh, get rid of that. Get a death pep. Healed. Now if she Lumi's, you can Putri, right? She has a death pip. Probably... For... Oh, she fueled, okay. Yeah, we're gonna get scales. Probably for catch, but I'm not gonna catch in this matchup. Not anytime soon. Uh, keep that. Go ahead and scales here. Now, she only has one more. And I do have tempo now, and I can paddle in. So we're okay. Sultan, don't want that. I'm keeping that for a Lumi. Tower? Huh. Well, let's uh, go ahead and get a balance pip. Honestly, I think you could queen here. Get a storm pip then. Because there's no way she's going to hit and heal right now. Right? You don't want to sit on pips. 
And you have another one in for later. So yeah, I'll take that. Although now she could um do me. Bait the pew tree. Then back for kinda suck. Uh we'll deal with that. Okay, I do not think that is word. I just didn't crit. Okay. Press. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Uh, I got a bounce pep. I think I'm just in a wand. I just like, <laughs> I got nothing better to do. You know? Like, I'll take the damage while she's infected. Yeah, I'll take that. I want a bubble. Okay, I got one. I would loom me and bait a pew tree. Goat monk, wow, okay. So that's a really bad hit and a really bad heal, which is really good for us, basically. Um, okay. I mean, it did the same as my queen, to be fair. All right, that's fine. Uh, get a storm pup. My headset is dying. I don't need that. Um, honestly, I think you could probably just Catalan. You know, like, she's not healing. It's a bad hit now, and you're running out the brace, right? I like that. Yeah, and you don't sit on pips. I like that. That should still do, like, a 1200, maybe. 15, yeah, not bad. Levy, don't want that. Hmm, attrition. Hard to say. Shield, okay, perfect. So, she is running out her own aura, which we like, good. We like that a lot. Now, I can bury to mitigate a bit of damage that's incoming. Dark and Stormy, that's good too. Okay. I think a JD is the move. I do not have it, unfortunately. But, uh, I think bury is good. I don't want that. Uh... Yeah, I mean, why not? You gotta start healing anyways, right? You've taken a thousand. This will heal a thousand. The brace is gone, and she's at max pips with the debuff. So, I think we're winning by a lot, right? Yeah, kinda. Get rid of that, get rid of that. Is that a hit and bubble? Okay. Hmm. Now, I think I can blade because... I'm already ahead if I blade, I think, right? Yeah, I like that. I like that. She could combo, but so could we. It goes both ways. We'll see. Get a golf. Steel word's good. The shuffle's a bit early, and I do need that in this matchup. Grace, yeah. Okay. Oh, yo, she's a freak, bro. Oh, nah. Hey. Bro, tower. Wait, I need a bubble. Wait, I need a bubble now. I need a bubble now. Okay, that's a good pull, and that's a good pull. Okay. Yeah, that's really good if she goes for her wings. She might wings, we'll see. Was that a weakness? 
Okay, I'm gonna keep the attrition y'all because I think she'll wings. Um now I think you're gonna take their Sulka. Because you don't need to heal, right? It's a Rasulka, you know. We might get the blade back as well. And we get another shot. So we're just really keeping the pressure on her right now. Yeah. Okay. Heal blade. Alright, whatever. <laughs> whatever, bro. Okay. I like the hand a lot. Okay. We are okay. Is that a wings? Wow. Okay. She really just hit right through that. Okay. Again, my best move is the bubble right now. I don't know. That does like what? 14? 2,000 for- Oh my god, that did a lot. Okay. Uh, get rid of that. To be honest, man, I think that's your move. You want your hand to be a bit better before you throw yourself out there and overextend, right? We're already winning, so... I like that. If she sanctuaries, I can heal the max as well. That's good. Maybe I don't even bother going for a Catalan. Because uh, I could queen into a Rasulka, right? Yeah. Damage. Oh. Uh, get rid of that. Power. I haven't pulled a single two pip. I wanna cry. I wanna cry, dude. Minnow? Huh. Maybe. Zillward? No, you JD here. Okay, so. I think what we are going to do is get rid of that and that and do that. Now she can't hit me at all. I'm a bit concerned about that balance pip because she might have a gearhead destroy her. Destroy. Eh. Destroy. Can't say that. Okay. <laughs> you know what I meant. Got a bubble. Okay. And a shrike. Not too shabby. I mean, I'm not really afraid of her. I don't think I need a Catalan, y'all. Because I'm already. I've already done the hard work. Yeah, I don't need a Catalan. Oh god. All you have to do now is Aura, Shrike, and like Queen or Sulka. Nice bubble. I'm not sure I even need to heal, but I will keep it for now. Because I have a 45 heal blade, right? So yeah, we're about uh, even in terms of health, but I have a lot more tempo. Okay, yeah, she's really messing up. Okay. We're gonna wand and apply pressure. Again, we are running out that aura. I think it is her third brace or second. Now we can queen into our Sulka. And I did get the Galvanic. Yeah, now I can Galvanic Shrike. And close it out. JD? Okay. Yeah, I had to get rid of my Elf. I think I have one more in though. Okay, let's say you Aura and she hits. Do you care? Hmm. Not really, because you just strike and win. Right? Yeah, I don't have a Catalan, but Elf, good pull. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. 
We'll see what she does. Daddy probably? Right. Now, I think our move is to elf and then shrek. Because the elf will knock off the towers and her brace will be out, right? Yeah, she's doing a lot of damage. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna go for the elf here. Then I say we shrek and like we're Soulco Queen. I don't think I need her shuffle. She does not strike me as a jade. So I think I will be getting rid of that. Etch. That's pretty good too, actually. Um Yeah. I'm gonna get rid of that, y'all. I think I can kill her confidently. If she caddies here, we strike. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Art, I mean, do you? you could, oh, no. She got a death pep. She could dispel. What if you queen? Okay, I think you're gonna queen. I, I, I wanna queen first because. The elf is gonna do a lot. This will do a decent bit. This just really helps me get the tempo, and now a Shrek will just be devastating. And I know she's not healing her way a little bit now. His life can do that. Right? So yeah. Yeah, I'll take a thousand. I'll take a thousand and no heal. Get rid of that. I don't think you want that, do you? No. You could like double shot almost. Chikuchi? Yeah. That's kind of why I don't like the heal blade on Rasulka, in case you're wondering. But uh, it's okay. It's alright. We can. Uh... I think I'm gonna dark and stormy. I'm gonna slow things down just a little bit. I don't wanna risk dying and getting like two tapped, you know? And I know our Sulka won't do enough for 40. Yeah. Just slow it down a bit, right? You're okay. You're okay, Liam. Got to pull for a crack in here. We have one more crack inside. Is that a bubble? Yeah. Okay. So you're gonna have to hard pull for that crack in right there. You're gonna have to. Uh. Yep. She's trying to heal. Okay. I don't need to go on the defense. No crack in. Okay. Bubble. That's alright, you can heal and uh, farm a shad to strike Rasulka, right? He's not killing me anytime soon. I know that. Rasulka, the pierce. Got the Kraken, okay. I need a buffed Kraken to kill her. Wait, is that it? No, but she's healing. Uh, let's see. I think a buffed Kraken can do 2k, right? What is she at? It's fine. I gotta be careful here. Oh my god, wait. Guys, guys, guys. I think this is it. Holy cow, I think this is it. I think that- I think that's it. I think that's it. It's a buffed Kraken on a storm. This wasn't even close. You're dead. That does like 2.3. Oh my god. Please. <gasps> Yo, we did it! Yo, we did it! No way! 
Yo! Bro, Warlord on the worst school at max level. The hardest school to play. And one of the worst ones. Oh my god, it's been a long time coming. It has been a long time coming, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god, bro. Oh my Yo, we did it. We did it. <laughs> yes, dude. I'm the only storm up here. That's crazy. And I didn't even lose, right? I didn't. These two losses were snipes. Oh my god. I cannot believe it.